what's up so I quit my job day five um, I gotta say this is definitely my favorite video that I've made so far so I kind of had a breakthrough today um, breakdown last night and then breakthrough today and um, so last night was sort of like the purge of emotions I literally uh, talked to my mom for a couple hours and bawled my eyes out I went through like every emotion feeling like I'd made a mistake and why did I do it and I mean I even thought about doing going back to school and doing my PhD and I'm so happy my mom she said that's not why you quit and she said Danielle you wanted this you were telling because I was in Dallas she lives in Dallas I was just in Dallas um, about a month ago and she said Danielle you this is what you wanted this is what you said you were gonna do and I was like I know I just didn't know it was gonna feel like this but um anyway it felt so good to get all that out and then I woke up this morning and I worked like legitimately worked I got up at 6 30 actually 5 30 about 5 45 talked to my daughter walked the dogs worked on my company for about five hours maybe six hours with one break well a couple little breaks but then like one long break and then um worked on some other stuff around the house and now I'm like I'm so happy because I'm down here at the river and um I was thinking like I just feel so rich right now you know I'm manifesting a beach into my future I really want to live on the beach um I've been saying that my whole life and I was thinking you know if I live because they say you know if you want to manifest something you have to feel it and so I was thinking if I lived on the beach um, right now would I do the video in my apartment or would I go out to the beach and I was like I'd go outside I'd go out to the beach so we're at we're at the local beach we're at the river um, it's lit up today too because um, we've got scooters now <laughs> I'm gonna go take I'm gonna check them out I was gonna go I went I tried to go yesterday but um, I didn't have my wallet on me and anyway they look really fun they go so freaking fast so um, I'll show y'all my apartments they're pretty legit and talk about getting over some major fears um I, there's several people out on their balconies and i'm sure they can hear me and they're probably looking at me but um they're they're me we're all one right so who cares um i just feel so free and rich and blessed and so anyway today um it just felt really good to get work done um, basically doing the same work that I wanted to do at my previous job but wasn't allowed to so it felt really good to be able to work and not have to worry about anybody's coming and chastising me or getting me in trouble for being productive um, so that was exciting um, I, I have I came up I think I came up with a really good app idea I'm not gonna say what it is yet but it's on the level of um, it's in the, this it has to do with um, spirituality and um, uh, affirmations and stuff like that but um, anyway I think it'll really help people it's something that I want for myself and I looked for it and I didn't see it well I didn't look for it that hard but I don't think it exists yet so I, that's why I said I don't want to say what it is I want to do a little bit more research on it but um, yeah I might be developing an app as well and so I'm just super excited um, oh and so then another thing I did today was um, and I know y'all probably don't really care about what I do. Maybe you do. I don't know. But I'm, I just, like I said, I want to document this whole um, process because um, it, for one, it keeps me, it keeps me um, accountable. Um, this is day 10, I think. Day 10, no drinking, vegan. Um, keeps me accountable. And it also gives me something to kind of look forward to. It's almost like a phone call that I look forward to to the universe it's like hey this is my giving back and I know my videos are just kind of me rambling right now but I think they'll be a little bit more structured in the future I just kind of wanted to get it going um, anyway so um, another thing that I did so I started packing um, I live in Wichita right now but um, I'm not I don't think I'm gonna stay here in fact I know I'm not gonna stay here unless some miracle happened but I I don't see it happening um, I'm probably gonna go either to Texas or California but I'm thinking Texas that's where um, I'll probably spend a lot of time in California but Texas is where um, urban air mobility is coming first and they're committed to 2023 to uh, uber elevate so you guys got to check that out 
if you don't it's okay I'll do a video on it coming soon it's gonna that'll take some preparation um, anyway um, so yeah I'm probably going to Dallas I think maybe in two months and um, so I started packing my lease is up in a couple months and I know I'm not gonna stay here and so um, I was packing today and so I've been watching all these YouTube videos and I keep hearing about the alchemist and alchemy and all that stuff. And I, I looked it up one time and it had, I just knew it had to do something with like turning stuff into gold or something like that. But I never really knew what it meant. And then um, I'm packing my bookshelves and I, I put a bunch of books in the box. And then all of a sudden the alchemist, brand new on my bookshelf. I have never bought that book. I have no idea how that book ended up on my bookshelf. I think it might have belonged to my ex. But um, I was like, it's only maybe 150 pages. It's not a long book. So I was like, well, I'm just going to um, check this out and see what they're talking about. And I could not put it down. I read, I'm like on page 80 something. And I just sat down. I was like, oh my gosh, it's speaking to me. That book is so powerful. So I'm, I don't know how it's going to end, but I'm really excited. It's like exactly what I'm feeling like right now exactly what I feel like I'm going through um, the boy I guess his name was Santiago yeah that's um, who I feel like right now and so um, I'm really into that book right now so anyway I'm I know it's just stuff I've been I'm like I can't believe how much time I have quitting work and quitting drinking I'm working two jobs developing a company developing an app um, packing, working out, spending time with my dogs, read half of a book, and now at the river doing a YouTube video. And it's still light outside, and it's been light. I didn't get up at dark. The sun was like right just coming up when I got up. I'm like, dang, I was wasting all my money at that job, and then going and drinking the night away. And that was my routine every day. Maybe a maybe half hour, hour with the dogs, if they were lucky. Um, yeah, it's like, no way, I'm not going back. I today was definitely a good day um, sent a lot of powerful emails set up some good stuff um, a lot of solid things happened today so I'm really excited um, do I regret quitting my job not one bit not one bit is it scary yeah it is it's but what did they say there was a quote in the book um, I can't remember what it said but it was something about the unknown and about just how our fears are not real and um, anyway I can't remember what it was but it, um, yeah, so anyway, uh, I guess that's it for me. I don't really have a lot to talk about today. Um, just that day five, um, there was a major, no tears today. Um, I think this is the first day that there were not any tears. So that's good. And like I told you, the, I don't know if you, yeah, the scooters. <laughs> there were so many of them coming by earlier. That's exciting. I'm definitely going to have to try those out. So, all right. Well, I guess that's it for me. Put a thumbs up and please subscribe and um, check out my music. If you didn't know that I did music, yeah, I have some music videos. Um, I might do music again as well. If I do, it'll be on some 432 Hertz shit. Um, I, I was into, I was, I was up on the 432 Hertz conspiracy, like back, mm, I knew about that from like probably 2012, maybe 2011. And, um, I was looking for 432 Hertz beats and I don't remember if I ever found any. I don't think I did. I remember looking. I don't think I found any, but, um, I think I could make some and then maybe like rap on those if I did music. But with all this new time I have, I might have time to because the day, the night is still young. Fuck alcohol. Fuck work. <laughs> Fuck a job. I like work. I had fun working. Oh, a little, a little butterfly just came behind the camera to say hi. Um, but, um, if any, tell me, I want to know something about you. Tell me something about you. I reply to everybody that, um, leaves a comment. So tell me something about you. Say something. Um, if this video resonated with you, put a thumbs up. If it, if it didn't tell me a video that you would want to see me talk about and I'll do a video on that. Um, I have a lot of growth to do in the realm of vlogging. Um, I used to be super scared to talk in front of the camera and I don't care anymore after I realized that we're all one and you guys are just me so it's all good <laughs> but um 
Yeah, I think this is good for a video because I've blabbed your guys' ears off in so many of the other videos. So, um, good night and, yep, peace, love, all that good stuff. Bye.